Alright, um, subpart E, track appliances and track related devices, sub 2, statute 213-201, the subpart pres prescribes minimum requirements of track appliances and track related devices. Statute 213-205, derails, 205A, each derail shall be clearly visible on the track, guidance of the track safety standards requires the derails to be clearly visible when the track safety standards does not comply with the specific color details are to be painted, they must be visible for the railroad employees and derail dark and colors obstructed with vegetation would not be in compliance. Statute uh, 205B. Or 205B, when locked in position, a derail shall be free of a loss of motion that which would prevent it from performing its intended fun function. Guidance. Inspectors will need to determine if the extent of the movement due to the worn parts and proper adjustment, if any, determine if such movements render and derail an activity. Statute 205C, each derail shall have... Um, um, each re derail shall be maintained to the function as intended. Guidance derails are various designs. May be the following type: switch point, switch point, spring switch point, sliding hinge, or portable. Derails can be operated with various means: electronic, hand throw, lever, mechanical rod. For the point of other than the derail, they should be installed with the derail rolling stock in a direction away from the track or facility to be protected. In addition, with the requirements of this section, a switch point type of the derail must also comply with the requirements of Statute 213-133, Turnouts General, and 213-135, Switches. 205D, each derail should be properly installed for the rail to be which is applied. The paragraph D is applicable to September 21, 1999, Guide Rail. Uh, gui guidance. Derails must be proper size for the, for the rails which is applied. The derails are manufactured by size man based on a rail section to which they are applied or should be installed. According to the manufacturer's instruction, the installation of a derail or incorrect size can be made a derail in ineffective. Inspectors may use the derail manufacturer instruction specifications as a guide to determine the derail properly installed. Correct size for the derail is to which it is applied. Derails are made are made by hand, right or left. The derail equipment is specified side of the track. In addition, universal derails will de de um, derail equipment in either direction. A derail installed with the derail equipment toward the main track or should otherwise protect what was constituted improperly installed derail. A hand derail placed in a wrong direction would also constitute an improperly installed derail. Alright, subpart F.